Great excitement today as developers Pfizer and BioNTech confirmed they have developed a vaccine for the COVID-19 virus, which will prevent 90% of people from getting infected. So far, the vaccine has been tested on 43,500 people in Turkey, South Africa, Argentina, Germany, Brazil, and the United States. No issues relating to safety were reported. The speed at which the vaccine has been created is unprecedented. The pharmaceutical companies hope to get emergency authorization to use the vaccine before the end of November and expect to supply 50 million doses by year's end. The scientific community acknowledged that there is still a long way to go, but there is still great optimism, with the vaccine being labeled a milestone, and suggestions that the world could return to business as usual by spring of next year. One of the issues facing governments in issuing the vaccine is who would be eligible for it first. With the elderly being most at risk, some have suggested that they should be first in line. However, hospital workers and staff at care homes, who are vital to care for the sick and are exposed more frequently to the virus, are also a high priority. The matter is still under discussion and no final decisions have been made, though it will undoubtedly be the focus of much public debate in the coming weeks. It is likely that people under 50 who show no symptoms will be the least likely to be vaccinated.